Let's talk about control plane security. Now, we know that there are multiple planes in the router, okay? There's the data plane where end user traffic goes from one interface through the router directly to another interface. The RP is not involved at all. There's also management plane traffic, and that's just what it would seem. Traffic destined to the router via SSH, um, Telnet, HTTP, something used to manage that router. And finally, there's control plane traffic. Control plane traffic usually involves our routing protocols. Okay, packet comes into the to an interface. The interface knows that traffic is destined to the router itself. It punts it to the RP where it sits in a queue, and the RP will eventually get to it, process that routing protocol, and you know find the best path, store that in the table, do the next packet, and so on and so forth. That's great, but where does security come involved? Well, what happens if we have a malicious attack from the outside sending thousands upon thousands of control plane traffic to the router, okay? The interface is going to get it. It's going to punt it to the RP. It's going to sit in that queue, okay? And what's going to happen is that queue is going to build up. It's going to build up and finally it's going to fill up and we're going to have tail drop of all traffic after that. That includes legitimate traffic. Not something we really want to happen. So with control plane policing, or some control plane security, what we can do is have a filter in place saying, okay, I only want to receive so much of this protocol level traffic on the control plane for this type of protocol traffic. Let's so say OSPF. I only want to receive, let's say, a thousand packets per second. The RP can handle a thousand packets per second and no problem. So what happens if we get an attack, we're going to get a thousand packets getting into that queue, the rest are going to be tail dropped, okay? Now, there might be some legitimate traffic being dropped, but it's better than the CPU being so busy that it cannot process any other type of traffic. So control plane security, we use it to protect the RP and make sure it's available for other types of traffic.